what's up guys this is your girl Mizuki and welcome back to my channel so today we're going to be doing a review the title is called and the review is all about the markers of Parku so the company reached out to me and they wanted to send me this uh, box of 36 colors and I wanted to review them so I was looking them up and stuff like that so I saw that they kind of look similar to the sharpie or the Bic marker uh, look at this this is what they I got So I got a set of 36. Now, the packaging, it looks super, super rad, I think. Very cool. Like, the translucent, obviously. And then they have, like, the whole front cover design over here on the, on the back. And you can actually purchase these on Amazon. I'm going to tell you about the price. So, uh, the price for 36 of them is really, really good, actually. The price on these on Amazon is $12.99. And if you are a Prime member, you get free fleet delivery you get free delivery <laughs> now for 36 markers $12.99 isn't bad at all and plus it's free delivery so I definitely wanted to try these out so I told them to send them to me and yeah so they sent them to me yay so let's see what they look like which they do resemble the sharpie so they do resemble the sharpie so I'm gonna pull one out right here and this is what it looks like same packaging, not same as the Sharpie. This is beige. The Sharpie is gray and the color on the top, same thing. Now the only difference between these markers and the Sharpie is the tip of the, the marker, the actual nib. So look at this one. So this one has a really, really sharp end to it compared to the Sharpie. I'm actually going to go get a Sharpie for you guys so you guys can see and compare. So this is the difference. So the Sharpie is the pink one and the Parku marker is the blue teal one. So look at the look at the difference on the nib. Let me just um, go a little bit closer. So you see it's a little bit longer than the other one. And then the Sharpie is definitely shorter. Is it? Is it grabbing it? There you go. You can also shop at their website. Right her. And yeah, it says, uh, obviously it says, please, attention please, small parts included. Do not give to three year olds, under three. And yeah. So, I'm going to show you some swatches. So, let's go. Here are the swatches, guys. Look at that. I even did like a nice little a bubble letter parku kind of thing here. So, on the right side of me, it's going to be all the brown tones. Then the green, the blues, the yellow orange, the pinks, and the purples. So, let's go. So, I was looking at the colors and for 36 colors, I think... It doesn't look like 36 colors, just to let you know, right? Um, but no, it, I find that the colors, they have a little bit of everything. They have two brown tones. They have two gray tones. Uh, they have a semi. I think this is kind of a brown, right? It's like a warm gray. Uh, we have the teals, like the nice greens over here. We have a variety of greens to light green. They have uh, the navy blues, the light blue on the top this is how they were sectioned by the way I didn't organize it this way I like to do my swatches like how they actually set up in the box but obviously I would do it a little bit differently because there's some stuff that is like misplaced like for example um, this blue the light blue would be with this blue over here I would put it with the rest of the category this one is like a nice like aquamarine and I would put it with the greens so we have a little bit of everything we have your oranges your pinks and uh, like a burgundy but I feel like that looks like more of a brown but it, it's considered like a, a burgundy and yeah what do you guys think comment down below and let me know if you have these markers I'm actually gonna give them away because I have so many markers I actually did on my Instagram I did a big big giveaway with my Arteza the 62 set markers and somebody won that so if you guys like to participate please follow me on my Instagram I'm gonna put all my information on the bottom right here or the link down below anyway so I'm gonna give you some pros on the marker so the pros are that the tip on these are so much better I feel like than the sharpie because the sharpie eventually like it gets a rounder tip I understand these but if you 
The thing is with the Sharpie, if you constantly use the nib on its point, since it's just around already, it loses it. It's like shape. So I'm pretty sure it's going to lose the shape too, but I feel like with the brush, you can actually use the sides a little bit better than the Sharpie. I don't know if you guys understand me. I hope you guys do. <laughs> but I feel like the duration of the sharper of the sharpness of this tip is going to last you longer than a Sharpie would because a Sharpie it is sharp in the beginning, but these sides aren't meant to be used. Do you understand? Like, you know, when you do use it on the side, it has like a, like a raspy kind of, uh, let me show you, let me show you, let me show you. All right, so this is a Sharpie. Oops. See how it has like that red, it's like not, I don't know if it's meant to, like, it has like a, sh like a, you know, I don't know. So that's the Sharpie, guys. Look, you see, Sharpie. All right, so this is the Parku. I don't know if it's Park O or Park Q, so I'm sorry if I get it wrong. So this is the, you see it's so much smoother than the other ones. Actually did it sitting down, it was so much better. See? Compared to the Sharpie, I feel like the Sharpie I don't know. This one has a like more flexible uh, tip than the rest. Another pro for the markers of Parco. Like I said, I don't know if it's Park O or is it Park Koo. Like boo, but this is Koo, you know. But anyway, just to let you guys know, don't yell at me down below, whatever. Around the same price, I have it right here on my phone. So it says here the count of 24 Sharpies on Amazon is $13.50. And I don't see anything about free delivery, but it says Prime and it has a little check. And this is the one from uh, Parku, uh, $12.99. And it says free shipping. 12, $12.99, so you have $13, bucks. so it's definitely a little bit cheaper, and you get 36 markers compared to the Sharpie that gives you a count of 24. Um, I really didn't look up the amount of, like, sh the, the biggest Sharpie set, so I'm going to actually look that up now. I actually found on Amazon, um, I don't see it in stock, but there is a count of 115 fine tip, ultra fine, twin, and chisel tip for $84.34. So this is what it actually looks like, guys. That's crazy. I didn't even know they actually sell like a big bundle like that. But if you guys are interested in getting that, that would be cool too. I'm, I'm like, you know. But like I said, I feel like the amount that's from $24 of $24 from 24 markers to $13.50 and compared to 36 markers to $12.99 I would rather go for the $12.99 and the the colors aren't that bad either way so you get a little bit of everything so I do recommend these definitely I feel like they go really smooth because I did like the whole nice bubble letters they do not streak unless you go over it like you just have to know how to like when you color it in you can do circles to avoid streaks but I did um, up and down strokes but I didn't go overlap on them because you know when you overlap them they do get a little bit darker so that is it I hope you guys enjoyed this review on the parkour or the parkour um, uh, before I actually end this video, I wanted to remind you guys that I will be giving these out today. So head over to my Instagram and see what are the rules to participate in winning these. I actually gave away my Artessa 62 set marker to some lucky person. The reason why I'm giving these and my markers away is because I don't... I have so many markers. I don't know if you guys had my studio tour i have so many markers and i feel like i do not use them and they just collect dust and they dry out so i prefer giving it to somebody that actually is going to use them so if you guys are into art or love doing all that marker stuff creating stickers and stuff like that uh definitely participate in winning one of these and yeah 
that is it i just wanted to remind you guys to head over to my instagram my social media is right here don't forget to follow all my other social media and also don't forget to like and comment down below don't forget to even subscribe subscribe to my damn channel okay and that's it i hope you guys enjoyed it i know the glare on my glasses is kind of like like just probably annoying you guys so i truly truly apologize don't forget to subscribe and yeah this is your girl mizuki and i am out Pew!